So, whoop, one thing I want to speak about, because obviously we have a chit chat about everything, um, is the BBC One Panorama uh, documentary that's on tonight. Now, I've just gone on to Google to find the link, and even on Google, you'll see that there's um, lots and lots of news coming out on the media. Uh, from BBC News, The National, City AM. I don't know who they are, City AM, The National. No anyway, idea. for the last uh, two hours, three hours and five hours, there's lots and lots of top stories on Bitcoin. And the main theme seems to be criminals um, and crypto cash with la money laundering and stuff. So um, I've got a sneaky suspicion that the panorama thing tonight will be like biased you know sort of going on about the criminal side of bitcoin and crypto so i think um, they'll basically basically be bashing it yeah they will i it's reckon dreadful and it's crashing and whatnot people lose their <coughs> people life. lose all their money and things <laughs> yeah. like that it's bound to be yeah so um on the on their website basically says let's let's read this for you hold on right can you still see it jen yeah <laughs> Okay, it says, who wants to be a Bitcoin millionaire? Um, it's only 30 minutes long, so they haven't got long to bash it, but I'm sure they will manage. Um, Bitcoin is the world's leading virtual currency, but unlike real money, it is not backed by a government or properly regulated. Good. <laughs> <laughs> Bitcoin is exchanged and held digitally by users. Which is attractive to criminals. Here we oh, go. For sake. I'm not a criminal, or are you? No, I'm and not. Are a lot not of yet. <laughs> we might be. Carry on in crypto. Do. <laughs> uh, which is attractive to criminals selling drugs, pornograph oh, pornography, oh. and arms, uh, and normal people like me and you. Yeah. <laughs> but now Bitcoin <laughs> is moving. <laughs> yeah. But now Bitcoin is moving into the mainstream and being openly marketed as an investment opportunity. Panorama investigates what Bitcoin is and what it means. I wonder if they actually know. Going inside a Bitcoin mine in Iceland. Oh, that'd be interesting. Oh, yeah, it will. Uh, where currency is made. And spending time with Bitcoin millionaires of Silicon Valley. Uh-oh. <laughs> okay. Uh, the programme also hears from others who have been scammed out of their life savings. Do not, do not, do not, do not, do not put your life savings into crypto. But it's their choice if they want to. Yeah, but you do. I wouldn't personally. <laughs> but the people have. Yeah, but it's they're just not stupid. Idiots, it? No, it's just how they're feeling. See, I'm the... They want to do it, but I wouldn't I wouldn't even go. See, Jan's been really nice, but I mean, I would say it as it is. But no. I, I, I get, look, I get what you're saying. But why on earth would you put I your life know. savings into something that's so volatile and risky? Because they think they're going to. Is it greed? Quick. It's not. You don't think it's greed? No. I think people are just... Greedy? No. <laughs> <laughs> no, they think, they think they can take a chance and hopefully it'll work out. Yeah, but, is but that not, does that not come down to greed no, of money? No. No. I don't think it does. What is it then? I don't know. It's not... <laughs> 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 well, leave your comment but below if you know what it is. People want a better life. They want a better life, and they're hoping that it's going to make them a better life. Mm. And they just chance it, don't they? Yeah, but the whole life but savings. I, I couldn't do it. I couldn't it's do it. Such a risk. I mean, it's look too at the, risky to do that. Yeah, but you look at the people that lost on BitConnect. I, I, I know we lost, but we didn't. Obviously, we don't work yeah. with our life savings. Um, we work with our own strategy. But look at. BitConnect, the people that said they lost their life savings. That's it, there was a lot. And I do feel for them, I really do. I can't yeah, right. Well, I do as well, but why on earth do you not do your research and get some education behind you in the cryptocurrency market and realise that it's volatile and you could lose everything? I mean, every YouTube channel you watch, everybody says, "Do this word drives me mad, do your due diligence. <laughs> Do, do, I can't even say do do. Go say it again. I'm losing my voice anyway. Do 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 diligence. Um, so so every single channel that we watch, they always say it. They say it all the time. So who are they watching? 
This this leads me on to our next uh, topic. They're tonight. probably watching all the ones that are millionaires showing off the cars, showing off their aeroplanes, showing off everything, and they're probably thinking, "I want all that." Yeah, but is that greed? No, <laughs> it's just hope, isn't it? Yeah, all right then. It's just hope. Okay, so yeah. where was I? Going I back know, to the but actual. I still wouldn't do it. No, I wouldn't either. Uh, Little so, steps. So do you do 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 diligence? Um, the program also hears from others who have been scammed out of their life savings and investors who think the cryptocurrency is an enormous scam and that the writing is on the wall. Yeah, we're all going to make money, baby. Oh, God. You sound like someone. <laughs> I know who you mean. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> who we'll talk about in a minute. No. I'm only no. joking. <laughs> um, but yeah, so, so uh, in Britain and around I... the world, what? I think it's an opportunity of a lifetime, but do it little steps. I think we're in just at the right time. Bitcoin's so you don't think go. it's too late? No, definitely not too late. Why? Be- because it's not. <laughs> it's at low prices, but we're still higher now than we were a few years back. It's yeah. still doing really oh, I know. well, it's even what... though it's gone on a little dip. But corrections, isn't it? It always crashes, and it always goes back up, and it always goes back down, and then it always goes back up, but... When they say it's crashes, it's a dip. It's yeah, a correction. Exactly. But the mainstream media say crash, and, and it frightens everything. Everyone. This is probably what they're going to talk about tonight. Friends then. of mine, when I've mentioned it again, laugh and go, "Oh no, it's crashed." I heard something on the telly about mm-hmm. Bitcoin. I don't know what it is, but I heard it, and it's all crashing. So it scares them from investing. <laughs> it absolutely terrifies them. They won't do it. They're they don't even scared. know what it is anyway. No, they don't understand it, and they've admitted that. Yeah. So it says in Britain. And around the world, authorities are sounding the alarm. Ding, 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 ding. <laughs> that Bitcoin. Or, ding, I know who you sound like now. Ding, ding, ding. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> sounding the alarm that Bitcoin is too risky. Is it too late or too crazy to try to become a Bitcoin millionaire? No. <laughs> I mean, it... it'd be lovely to be a millionaire. Obviously, everyone wants that. But it's just being financially secure, isn't it? That's what everyone wants, really. Yeah, that's what I want. That's what I want as well. I just want... What you really, really want. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, at the end of the day, that's what we all want. We want, we want to be financially secure. And anybody that wants more than that, I guess, are greedy. Maybe. But then no, where do you start? No. Because the more you have, the more you want. Yeah. A bit like the chocolate biscuits I'm eating now. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's right. Can't Once you start packing, you can't stop, and then it's empty within a couple of seconds. Well, it is with us. Right. <laughs> One biscuit, two biscuit, and then the whole packet goes. And then you're like, I wish I didn't eat those. Back onto the diet tomorrow. Um, so anyway, so who wants to be a Bitcoin millionaire? Oh, Me. <laughs> <laughs> that's on tonight. So. Yeah, it's quite interesting. We'll we'll see what that's like, but I've got a sneaky suspicion it will bash it and it'll scare lots of people off, which in a way isn't a bad thing. Um, but hopefully they don't twist it too much because I've had experience of the media before and they do tend to edit what they want. <laughs> that's true. Yeah, so what you see isn't really what you get. Um, so take it with a pinch of salt if you're watching it on the UK BBC tonight and as I say I will try and get something um, done tomorrow on it and let you know what happened might be able to watch it on catch up if you go on the internet and watch it on BBC iPlayer is that available in other countries? I don't know maybe no idea don't know no idea oh well might be able to watch it anyway our second little thing oh yeah our second little thing I want to show Jan now Let's see her reaction because she hasn't seen this yet. Um, can I just say something as well? Mm. I was looking on Spark. I Spark presume, is yes. a selling site in the UK. It by is the a way. selling site in the UK. A bit like eBay. Slightly, yeah, yeah, it's like that. Anyway, you can have a look all around the country at things, or you can just do it in the in like a few miles away from you. So I was just having a quick look as I usually do every now and again, see if there's any. All the time. <laughs> Once a day, anyway. <laughs> <laughs> Every now and then. Because I have had some bargains on there, which are brilliant. What did you so last? What a, was your last buy? Um, I bought a, <laughs> I bought a microwave for my kitchen, <laughs> a new integrated one. And it's amazing, um, and, and I got it so cheap. And all right then, I bought a hub, <laughs> <laughs> electric hub, which a uh, Bosch one, which was absolutely. 
bargain. It was brand new. It's perfect. And? Uh, no, I'm not going to get a toilet. So what about the All toilet? Right, <laughs> I bought a toilet that has been in the back of my car for a long Can time. Can I just say, right, this toilet, I don't know why she bought a toilet, because her toilets were actually perfect. And Jan saw a bargain of a toilet. <laughs> and bought, it was brand new. And bought a bar. toilet. And I've actually got a new cooker as well. And there's nothing but wrong with the toilets. Um, looking out for a little sink now for my downstairs toilet. Um, but anyway, going back to the schmuck site. <laughs> Excuse me, my voice is really bad now. Um, I was just having a look through and there was a bed for sale. Oh, no. And it was brand new. And I said, well, that looked quite nice. You I have a bed. It, I have a bed. <laughs> I'm absolutely fine with beds. But as you do, you have a look. And as I was reading through the sizes and everything, I thought, that's really nice. That one. Maybe in a year's time or something, I might get one like that. And as I went down the page telling me all the details, it said I could pay by PayPal. And I thought, oh, that's good. And then it said credit card, debit card. And then underneath, it actually said, and you could pay by Bitcoin Did it? or cryptocurrency. I nearly dropped off my seat. On Spock? On Spock. I nearly they're, they're died. They're accepting crypto? Not Spock itself. On this particular um, company site who's Amazing. selling the beds. I was that excited. I actually lost the, <laughs> lost the page and I had to pay. <laughs> I had to phone my friends who didn't believe it. Um, and she just didn't know what I was talking about. But I was really excited. Well, that's and I thought, good. my God, it's actually come at, like businesses are starting to use it, normal businesses. Don't you think, like, it, like I'm like, just to let you know, guys, I'm vegan, Jan's not. Now, when you meet another, I don't know whether it's, I guess it's like that, but when you meet another vegan, like, you, you've no idea who these people are, but you meet another vegan, whether it's online or in person. And it's like long lost friends and you want to put your arm around them and say, hello, it's like a family. Oh, God. And all the vegans are the same. It's like you just instantly make a connection. Now, this is like Jan with a crypto bed. <laughs> <laughs> I, bet she, I bet you wanted to email him and say, oh, I, hello, I did. crypto actually, person. I was actually thinking about that. I actually wanted to go, oh, my God, I'm so pleased that you're, you're selling these by crypto. And I was really excited. I knew and you I, would. I was so close to emailing them to say <laughs> see, And then see. I thought, no, because it sounds a bit stalkerish. <laughs> I'm not one of those type of people. So, there, you, so, so there you go. I've just hit the nail on the head. It's a bit like the vegans together. But, so fellow cryptos want to get in touch with each other. But that means that the mainstream, it is getting through to mainstream, definitely. <laughs> Until tonight's programme. Um, we, we've both had our own businesses. And I think... Entrepreneurs. If, I think if I was still carrying on with my business, which I closed about a year and a half ago now, um, just because I didn't want to carry it on, basically. 27 years of it. And, um, and if I had kept it going, I would have actually put cryptocurrency... As in payments. Yeah, because I think I we're both, just so you know, we're, we're both entrepreneurs. We've had our own businesses for many years. And I'm still in business. Jan now decided to, after 27 change years, career. change career. And certainly changed it totally differently. Yeah, and I think that part of being an entrepreneur is knowing when you want to change, you've got to shape shift, really. And you move with the market. You move with the way it goes. And you decide, you know, is it for you? No, you move on. And we have many fails and we have many hits. So it doesn't really matter how many businesses you have or whether it failed, whether it, you know, you learn from your mistakes and it enables you to move on into new areas. And we, when we found crypto, I mean, last year we did a lot of research and we've only been on YouTube since December. Mm, December and, yeah. you know, we listen to everybody, absolutely everybody. Um, we will talk about this because there's a, an issue I want to clear up on here. And you do get a bit <clears throat> obsessed watching YouTube Yeah, you videos. do a bit. You need to get a life. <laughs> <laughs> you know what they say, crypto never sleeps. It's true. <laughs> it's true. Um, anyway, I just want to, before we talk about that, I just want to show Jan something and see her reaction. She hasn't seen this. It's on my, I filmed it this morning. I was cleaning the snow off my car. And I it has to, been snowing here. Yeah, it was a lovely day though. So the, snow, though. the sky was really, really blue. There was snow on my car, and I thought, I just happened to look up in the sky, and I'm going to show Jan this video now. See what you think. What is it? Uh, right. Right, that's a bit weird. How strange. Now, I've seen something like that on on TV or the YouTube earlier. Did you? Someone was showing 
showing that. I thought it was really weird. There were planes in the sky. No, someone on YouTube. It wasn't telly. YouTube today. I've had a day off, by the way. <laughs> That's watching YouTube Now, if you again. can hear me in the background, it's just on my filming. It is I will put it on here. I did here. look and I thought, what's that? And then I switched so, off. If you can see, there's five, well, four or no, five. Four lines. Yeah, but I think there was five that was on behind. Oh. But there's four aeroplane things flying through the sky. But they were so, so high and they were going really fast, which is unusual because normally when the planes well, are high. There's a going up that way. Yeah, I know. Straight up. Yeah. Crossing the pass. Now, they must have been higher than the passenger jet. I thought it was really weird. And this is the second video. Hold That's on. a bit odd. Yeah, because I, I stopped That's there and then realised the passenger They're just... actually crossing. Crossing fast. It was really strange. Yeah, but that's not like a... So are they fighter jets? Were they scrambled for something? Is there something... We... See, I'm all into this conspiracy stuff now. Oh, don't talk to... Right, I'm sorry, <laughs> but apart from cryptocurrency, <laughs> I am obsessed by Las Vegas. The, the hey. biggest mass murder... What? It, Las Vegas. See, I, I don't know what she's on about. What? what, what, what? <laughs> Las Vegas, the biggest mass murder in the modern history and nowhere... On mainstream media, is it being mentioned? Is. And this Stephen Paddock, who supposedly has done it, I really think, with all the evidence that the YouTubers are coming up with, they're looking into it like minutely. It's not conspiracy. There's something going on. The police, uh, Las Vegas police, and the government are what actually mass covering murder, it. Though? Oh my God! First of October last year. Really? Honestly, they showed it for a day. That's it. You, 58 you... people were 58 people were killed and four, I think it was 450 injured and nothing's ever said about it. Well, if if I don't know anything about this, so I'll get a little chat I'm with Jan sure afterwards. Um, but if you do know about this and you also think there's a conspiracy going on with this, because it's a bit random. If um, you go onto YouTube and watch According to Joe, um, his not me. YouTube <laughs> channel, no, not you, his YouTube channel, uh, there's so many different That's ones. That's weird. Um, it's just trying to pop in my head. They come up all the time and I'm absolutely fascinated by it. I know it's America. But if it's in, in your, yeah, but if it's in America, like most of our viewers are from America. That's so true. maybe you guys know more about it than we do over here. Um, but I, I, I'm obsessed by it. I can't weird. stop watching it. Any YouTube that pops up about it. So what do you think about my planes then? Because they're a bit weird, aren't I they? Don't know. Yeah. So did they scramble fighter jets? They might not be planes. Could they be missiles? Because the the actual what do you call it? The white bit at the back. <laughs> Chemtrail. But it, they're so smooth. They're just like imperfect. I know, but sometimes chemtrails. Like here's another conspiracy. If anybody knows about chem lines. chemtrails, <laughs> that's another whole story. Um, but anyway. I don't know what they were. I think they were planes, but why were they so high in the sky? Why were they going so fast? Because I used to live. I've seen something on YouTube today. I know. I, and I looked look. and I thought I don't know what that is. And I switched it off because I was listening yeah. to something. And I just happened to look that up, so strange. I filmed it anyway. So you can see on the video, it's weird. So anyway, so I don't know what that was all about. So hmm, don't know. Maybe someone else who's listening to this knows anything about it. Yeah. What do you Maybe think they are? I don't know. Leave your comments below. Anyway, the other thing, because it's a proper little chat tonight. But um, I know we're going off the train. I know. Crypto. No, I know. Yeah, but it's a chitty chat with Jan and Joe, so it's a bit. Well, bit I've of got everything. my cup of tea, my English cup of tea, which I always have. She's such a goody goody. <laughs> I've got me coffee. <laughs> um, I always have my tea. <laughs> so it's ten to seven in the evening here in in UK land. Um, the other thing I wanted to address UK land. in UK <laughs> land, yes, where I am, and where you are, um, is I. Put a comment today or yesterday, I can't remember, on Oracle's page, Crypto Baller. You know who that is. Um, everybody knows who he is. Now, he's a bit of Marmite. You either love him or hate him. Um, I don't mind him at all. I actually enjoy, I think he's quite amusing. And I then, like PJ3, by the way. Yeah, okay, we'll come Sorry. to that. And then, <laughs> I'm no, not the reason. Yeah, all right, all right. <laughs> so, the reason I'm saying it is because I put a comment on because I was commenting on something he was saying. And I think he comes up with some really good stuff. I enjoy his channel. I like supporting fellow wolves because when I'm on that channel, I see myself as a wolf. However, when I'm off that channel, I must be a sheep because from what I can see online on YouTube is if you're with them, you're a wolf. If you're not, you're a sheep. Now, I'm not married, as he says, to any one platform and I'm not married to any one YouTuber and neither should you be. Jan and I... 
watch lots and lots of different channels. We have our favourites. We enjoy all their content. If we like something they say, we will comment and we will like it and we'll support the people that are on there. If we don't like them, we don't comment. Um, now, I watch the Oracle a lot. And, and I was so gobsmacked the other day. Did you see that thing, Jan? He put on our, our channel. Sisters. I know. Yeah. I nearly fell off. I nearly <laughs> spat the, my coffee over the dog. Um, so that was really good. And I, I actually said to him, thanks very much for that, because that was a real surprise, because I didn't actually think he'd ever put us on his channel. Now, like him or loathe him, he's got like over 20,000 subscribers. And the fact he actually announced our channel, channel I was really pleased so yeah thanks Oracle if you're watching this because I know you're subscribed um, I've got nothing against Oracle at all he has some amazing strategies sometimes he's a bit annoying Oracle you annoy me sometimes but the majority of the time I really enjoy his channel so you know everybody should like what they want to like everybody's different the other people we really like is adventure Adventures, I can't even say it. Adventures. Adventures in Bitcoin. Yes. I think he's brilliant. And yeah. we both really like yeah. him, don't we? Um, PJ3. And PJ3. And, and did, Mike uh, Michaels. And Mike Michaels, yeah. Hey, did you see PJ's little boy? Oh, he's so oh, cute. Oh, he's in the PJ1. He's so cute. <laughs> oh, my God, he's lovely. He was so lovely. So now oh, we great, know, right, obviously, most people know in crypto that PJ3 and Oracle don't really like each other. Right, they're always spatting, and I've seen Oracle go after people, um, and he's not nice. But I don't care because it's not my it's not my argument. I don't care at all. You know, you men have got so much drama going on in the crypto world; it's <laughs> unreal. So Jan and I do not get involved. Um, so I don't like drama. No, I, I don't. Like a piece do you know what? What I've noticed, I know, but do you know what I've noticed? All the women in crypto are really calm. Yeah, and just, so they are, are and they just get on with it and all the men go absolutely mad and they're all hating on each other we don't care we really don't care so we just have fun and you know if i'm on oracle's page i'm a fellow wolf i'll support everybody on there i enjoy his content some things i like some things i don't but that's the same on any channel we watch and we try and watch lots and lots and lots of different channels because as entrepreneurs you should know if you're in business that you learn by mistakes and you know and you learn by listening to all different people and if you are narrow minded and you just stick to one person you get brainwashed so we're not brainwashed with any one person um if we don't like what they're saying we question why we don't like it and if it goes against what we think we question why it goes against it and you learn from that thing you know it's I mean, what do you think? We blurt so much by people that we don't actually like that much because we question why we're not liking what they're saying. And then then we think, right, OK, have they got a valid point? And do you know what? Most of the time they do actually have a valid point. Which yes. is, yeah, I know I'm, I'm, I'm waffling, but it really did annoy me today. And I thought, well, uh, you know, each to their own. I can listen to who I want. And um, it's how you learn. So, you know. Jan. But we do get obsessed <laughs> with videos. It's terrible. Everybody's got their own ideas and you need to make your own mind up of what you're going to do as an individual, not what they're doing. But you get from every video near enough, you do get really good information yeah, exactly. somewhere along the line. So whether you like that person or not, whether they're miserable or they're happy or they're like, uh, I don't know, whatever they're doing and whatever they're saying you will always pick up some valid information. And there, that's... Are, there are a couple of people that I have to turn off if the video comes on. Well, you're not it? that keen on Oracle, let's be honest. Oh, sorry, Oracle. <laughs> but <laughs> I'm putting around the spot. That, I can listen to so much, watch so much, and then sometimes I have to turn off. But that, that's just But me. I really enjoy the yeah, channel. So yeah. Jan and so... I are really different in who we like and who we listen to. But when we get together to do investments... We still talk about... We things, talk yeah, about it and we people. and we see both sides of the story and we see why we like certain people, why we don't like certain people and Jan will come up with a good reason. And, I presume, uh, yeah. for me, I prefer, prefer people who are a bit calmer and they just speak and, um, yeah. I, I like you, because you're quite calm. I'm quite calm, yeah. And I'm yeah, not. So, like, yeah. <laughs> yeah. so I like people who have got a bit of personality, who are a bit feisty. Same, my people haven't got personality. No, I mean no. like a bit, you know, like, look, Oracle's got the charm, hasn't he? He, he? You know, I don't know whether it's charm or charisma or <laughs> gift gift of marketing. I don't know. But my background was marketing, so 
I, I quite like it. I quite like the, you know, he's, I mean, say what you want, but he's done really well but with his I channel. I like the gentleman called Christopher. I can't think of his second name. That's really oh, bad. The, but I watch him all the time. I find him so inspirational and the way he talks and... I, I quite know. like him I as well. So that's really, one we do agree on. I do actually really... I know what he's going to say each time, but I actually love listening to him all the time. So we agree on him, but there's lots yeah. of them that we don't agree on. But it doesn't yeah, matter. True. It doesn't matter because we bring to the table what we like and what we've learned. And you learn off every single different type of person. Um, so our favourites are PJ3. Yeah, PJ1. <laughs> yeah, little PJ1 because he's great. <laughs> we love him. Um, Adventures in Bitcoin, Mike Michaels, Oracle. Um, who else? Is like, uh, there's there's so oh, I, lo- I really like Crypto Love because he's all hands. Yeah. Like, he's boom shakalaka. <laughs> <laughs> That's so what he says. Funny. Oh, I and um, Ange- Angela. Angela, lady. Yeah, oh, she's Pops. lovely as she's well. Nice. Um, oh, what's her channel? Oh, for God's sake. Angela, I'll find it in a second. Angela, Angela, Angela loves crypto. Yeah, she that's loves, it. That's it. That's think, the one. She's I'm also sure got a beautiful is. backdrop. Yeah, the she sea. was in the sunshine and the sea. <laughs> and, and we're in the so snow and the cold and it's freezing <laughs> in the UK. And I like her. She's nice and calm. I like her. Yeah, she is. She's really, she delivers her channel really well, doesn't Perfect, she? She's yeah. really good. So we really like Angela. There's some great women in crypto actually now. There's not, not many. many. <laughs> snap. <laughs> snap. Um, there's not many, but the ones that are in are really good. And they're really calm. Guys, take note. Calm. Um, who else do we really like? And you'll all, you know, all of you will have your favourites. I some you people... like us then. Well, Maybe if you we don't, turn off. Too much, I was gonna say, yeah, yeah but true. if you don't like our channel, you just turn off it. We don't want negative comments. If you don't like us, don't watch. Simple as true. that. And if you do like us, put a nice little comment <laughs> and a little love heart. We like that. Well, oh, Valentine's Day. <laughs> oh, yes, Valentine's Day too. Yeah. Okay, then hearts. it's Valentine's Day on the fourteenth, so we expect lots and lots of love hearts coming <laughs> on our pages. <laughs> be nice. <laughs> <laughs> that'd be funny wouldn't yeah, it yes so I'm single so there you go yeah that'd be nice for me <laughs> Jan's after a boyfriend no I'm not no no, no. Jan's I after a boyfriend one. I don't need one my life's too busy with it. <laughs> independent women but Jan's after helpful. a boyfriend no, um, no. anyway so so that was that so please listen to Sorry, everybody unless he can speak French <laughs> oh yeah Jan's after a French man <laughs> I right, this is French this is Jan's ide- ideal type, right? So if you fit this bill, get in <laughs> this touch. This really, this is supposed to be about crypto. I know, no, it's not. It's just chitty oh, chat. Right, so yeah. Jan's ideal type, right? Don't say anything, Jan. Oh God, I don't know say what she's a word. Say. It's not right. True. He's got to speak French. He's he looks good in jeans and a t-shirt, and he looks good in a suit. He's built like a. <laughs> I don't mind. Like a, a builder. Belly. That's Bil- it. Yeah, builder. Yeah, he, like he needs strong. to be built like a builder. He strong. needs to have drive and ambition yes, and not be, in, be afraid to get cryptoed. Yeah. <laughs> if he's into crypto. If he's into Bitcoin, yeah. <laughs> it's a yes. It's even better. Um, he must <laughs> like Jeeps. Um, oh, yeah, I do. Because like we, all like, we all drive Jeeps. Um, and yeah, what else? Yeah. He's got to be housey. Not countryfied because Jan's more town Well, they're saying country. that. I'm looking at all the little... Oh, I'm looking at... No, you know what I'd like in <laughs> France, a little place in France. Only it's small, it's okay. With, With a, a turret. turret. <laughs> <laughs> He's going to have a turret. I don't, want to round you've always kitchen. wanted a I know, round I don't know kitchen. Why. I don't know why. I'm, I'm very housey. I like I like to think that I can have a beautiful house. It doesn't. I know it's probably not perfect for everyone, but yeah, but your house is nice. It's all right. It, it's just normal three bedrooms. It's nothing spectacular. Yeah, it's nice though. It's, it's all right. It's new. It's modern. Ish. Yeah. I yeah. wish it was modern earth, but, then, <laughs> but I would like a turret. I don't know why I've always had that in my head. She has, honestly. Would, honestly, it's like been a turret. year. She wants a turret. I know, a turret in France would be amazing. The turret you want is a windmill. No. <laughs> <laughs> because a turret will be a part of a square house. So actually, you just want all the floors going up in your turret. So that's a windmill. No, I really don't want a windmill. <laughs> I want it French. To recap the crypto things on tonight on BBC. This probably Jan started needs, already. Yeah. We've been on this for such I a long know. time. I um, know. Watch all the YouTubers. Don't don't get hooked on one in individual. Just watch everybody and like what you like. Um, the strange things going on in the sky. And Jan needs a man. No, I don't need a man. <laughs> so that's 
that's I don't. Right. Well, Actually, that's what. No, that's what I'm going to do. What? That's my plan. Find a man. Cryptocurrency. No, crypto. <laughs> if I do well in the crypto business, that is what I'm going to do. What? I'm buy a man? Buy, no. <laughs> I'm going to buy a turreted castle, just a little diddy one, in France. In the Dordogne area, that would be lovely. So you're talking about a chateau? Yeah. <laughs> Basically, it's like, that's not that it's small. Got a beautiful garden with loads of flowers. And, that's somebody yeah. else mows. <laughs> yeah, because I'm not really into mowing gardens. <laughs> <laughs> See, I'm a complete opposite. I'm a country girl. I like, I the, know, countryside. like the countryside. I've got horses. I know. Oh. I live in my wellies. You know, I've got horses and I like the outdoors. Jan likes the indoors and towns and shops. And I shopping. do like shops. I do like shopping. I hate shopping. Even if I've got my money, I like to look round the shops. Jan's the only person I know that will get up <laughs> at five o'clock in the morning, go shopping <laughs> and not come back till about ten o'clock at it's night. True. It's true. All day and come back with nothing. Especially with my best friend. Oh, Because un- she's unreal. into it. So she loves shopping as well. So. Whereas I'm yeah. in and out those shops in a flash. I hate it. I can't, I can't bear it. I do love I like nice around. things, but I'd rather order it online and it just be delivered. Oh, I do like looking at everything, especially housey stuff. I know. <laughs> That's my crypto goal. What? To get my turret. Buy a turret. Jan in a turret. So there's <laughs> any turret chateau. there's any turret owners out there, yeah. do get in touch. Only wants a little one, <laughs> only wants a little chateau with a turret. That's all. Uh, Actually that's a point. I've not seen I've not heard of any French crypto people on here. Actually, no. It's only been US and you Put it know. this way, if there was, it'd be her favourite. It would, definitely. <laughs> if anyone's listening. If there any Frenchmen out yeah. there that are into crypto. <laughs> <laughs> or anyone from the US that can speak French. Oh, yeah. Nice. French. I don't mind. You don't, French, don't have to be French. Okay, well, French-speaking, builder-like type, dark hair, preferably. Um, that's good at, um, oh, and has a hairy chest. Oh, yeah, do you I like, like hairy, hairy chest? chest? So do I, actually. I like hairy men. Not not gorilla hairy, but just <laughs> not like preferably just on the front <laughs> and not on the back. But just a hairy chest, like manly. Manly, that's what I'd yeah. like. Manly, but really kind. Yeah. Anyway, so that's that's it for tonight. I think we better stop there because oh, one last thing. What? Lupex, Lupex scammed me. Yes, you weren't in. I the... weren't in you. No, I wasn't you... in you. Lupex, which I'm really pleased about. Yeah, thanks for that. <laughs> <laughs> as you can see we are opposites yeah. um we yeah. do choose our own as well we yeah don't, we we, we, don't just... we do joint ventures yeah. for those of you that don't know we're in altcoins we're in trading uh traditional icos we do a little bit of um uh oh what's the word can't think anyway we do lots of different investments and also we really enjoy the lending platforms which are now changed to hosted staking however obviously as you know bitconnect Sort of scammed out. Well, they did. Uh, Devore sort of scammed out. Well, Whatever they did. happened. We, lo- <laughs> we lost on those two. Um, and go. we got noxed. I didn't go into Knox. <clears throat> oh, see, I did again. So there you go. Don't maybe listen I, to what I say. It, maybe I'm the one you need to listen to. <laughs> She's <now>. so calm. <laughs> so I got Knox. Jan didn't. Yeah. I got Lupexed. Jan didn't. I've got fine coin. Hopefully, fingers crossed that. So have good. I. Oh, yeah, you did. Yeah. yeah. But we have got investments yeah, between together. us as well. So it's good that we have a little bit of everything. And that's what we always say, you know, diversity is the key. You need to you need to spread it around and, you know, not worry about, you know, just one thing. Because if you put all your money into one thing, you've, you're bound to lose. So we do lose a little, but mainly win. And hopefully win big so I can get the turret. Yeah, well, we're, we're <laughs> after Jan's turret, so, you know. With two flags on the top. All right. So I think we'll leave it there. <laughs> Jan and a turret and strange things in the sky. Right. Okay. Have a great evening. Night, everyone. Bye. Bye.